Hello everyone. In this video, we will be sharing our wonderful experience in Shikhar Lodge, Dumling. While we were planning for our Sandakfu tour, we had many doubts in our mind, especially with regards to places where we can stay at night, especially at Dumling, which lies en route, because of lack of information about hotels and homestays over there. We therefore decided to make a video about the famous Shikhar Lodge in Tumbling in which we stayed during our journey in order to help those who are looking forward to this journey. Tumling is a small village in Nepal which lies on the way to Sandakfu and because of its remote location there are very few homestays over there. Amongst them Shikha Lodge owned by Nila Gurung is the oldest and is one of the best. Shikha Lodge has rooms suiting everyone's budget and preferences. We however chose a double bedded room with attached toilet which had a very beautiful view of the valley. All the rooms were well furnished and had a queen size double bed as well as a single bed. So if you are travelling in groups it wouldn't be a problem. It is also pertinent to mention here that they also have room which can accommodate 4 people. So, if you are travelling in large groups, it will not be a problem as well. All the rooms had electricity 24 into 7, at least during our stay, and the washroom had running water. You might also get warm tap water if it is warm and sunny outside by the virtue of solar geyser which they have installed outside the hotel. But in case you do not get warm water from the tap, 
then go to their kitchen and ask them for water for cleaning and washing and they will give you instantly for free they also provide free warm water for drinking one thing that should always be kept in mind is that these are remote places and therefore things that we take for granted in cities like electricity running tap water internet and wi-fi are luxuries over here therefore it is always advisable to use these resources especially water judiciously We booked our room over telephone and they gave us confirmation over WhatsApp. One thing which people are apprehensive about while booking rooms in homestays located in remote areas like these where you are not able to speak directly with the owner is that whether they have really taken your booking and allotted you a room. To be very honest, at first we were no exception. Since we were not able to get in touch directly with the owner Neela Di over phone, we therefore called Mr. Keshav Guru for the booking, who happens to be her brother, which was not known to us then. But what amazed us was that, despite this issue with communication, they have a very well managed booking system. And therefore, when we went there, without ever having a word with the owner, before our arrival, the owner welcomed us and showed us our room, thus relieving us of all our worries and doubts about the booking. We are providing here a screenshot of the room tariff as well as the contact number of all persons whom you can call for booking. Another thing worth mentioning is that you will get confirmation over WhatsApp only as shown in the screenshot displayed on the screen. And it is not a printed receipt with seal. But still it is trustworthy since this is a common practice in most of the homestays of North Bengal. So there is no need to worry about that. We would also like to mention here that since connectivity is an issue Therefore, there might be instances where you cannot reach them over phone. In that case, just leave them a message and they will reply you back for sure. The food here was just mouth-watering. They organized buffet for breakfast, lunch and dinner. Their chicken curry from the dinner buffet and jambu alu paratha from the breakfast buffet are just too good. Here's a sneak peek into their kitchen for you all.
hope that we have been able to answer all your queries that you had in your mind about this property. But still, if you have any questions, feel free to ask us in the comment section down below and we will try to answer them to the best of our knowledge. Thanks for watching.